Okay, can everybody hear me okay? All right, my name is Jesse Bradley. I am with the Right Here, Right Now uh, project. We are a nonprofit organization. I am the founder and the project, project dire uh, program director for this organization. Today, I want to speak on digital literacy, which is what we do. Um, we also work with uh, a national organization called uh, NDIA, which is National Digital Inclusion Alliance. And what we do is work with Congress on writing the bills to uh, pass for the uh, uh, for legislation for to, to pay for broadband, uh, digital skills, learning, and anything along those lines. So right now what I want to do is go through some of the definitions of, of uh, digital inclusion, uh, which refers to the activities necessary to ensure that all individuals and communities, including the most disadvantaged, have access to and use of information communication technologies. This includes five elements, affordable, robust broadband internet service, internet enabled devices that meet the needs of the user, access to digital literacy training, quality technical support, applications and online content designed to enable and encourage self-sufficiency, participation and collaboration. Digital, digital navigators, which, which is what I am, uh, we are individuals who address the whole digital inclusion process. Home co connectivity, devices, and digital skills with community members uh, through repeated interactions. Digital navigation services include ongoing assistance with affordable internet access, device acquisition, technical skills, and application support. Digital equity, which is a condition in which all individuals and communities have the information technology capacity that's needed for, for full participation in our society, democracy, and economy. Digital equity is necessary for civic and cultural participation, employment, lifelong learning, and access to essential services. So basically, we offer basic computer skills at this at this time, which these are some of the lessons that that we we do. Um, also, um, this graph here shows uh, from the National Skills Coalition, which is also part of NDIA, which they went out and found that workers with no digital skills exist in all age groups, but more prevalent prevalent among ages 45 and above. With digital literacy and access, um, you can actually um, be able to uh, have economic sustainability, be able to access healthcare systems, food, education, and common uh, and social content, community and social content. So, so um, I left my information here. If anybody would like to get a hold of me as far as uh, learning digital skills, because at this time I am working with Alamance County. I live here in Chatham and try to build a, a coalition where I wanted to teach digital literacy and, and had had success until now, until I met up with uh, uh, Bernie and his group. And in Chatham County, we had put together a, a group of organizations. I mean, in, in Albius County, we put together a group of uh, organizations where we, we wrote up our digital inclusion plan, where we're, um, once those funds are released, uh, for the Infrastructure Act, we'll be able to access that for digital training and also broadband access.